Hi, it's Rob Weedhaus with my press needs and the Crest Clamshell Die Cutter. Today I'm at our R&D Demo and Training Center, the National Steel Rule Tech Center. We have a partnership with National Steel Rule for the development of many of the methods and techniques of die cutting the exotic materials, such as your um, Falcon boards, your reboards, your Sved boards, uh, your Gilman Brother products, as well as your kiss cutting the membrane switch, your die cutting and embossing. And today I'm here to give you a quick tour. So I'm in my R&D clothing, if you will, and I'm going to give you a, a walkthrough of what we can do for you and exactly what it is that we do here for the industry. So let's take a look. Welcome. When you walk into the National uh, Tech Center and MPN Training Center and R&D facility, you walk into the classroom. Now this is where we would perform the classroom style training of maybe die making, maybe die cutting. An example might be the use of the dual heater embossing. So we can go from theory then into the press and right on press for hands-on training. But the, one of the emphasis here is the R&D effort. And to do R&D, we need die making. Here you see an auto bender the National has installed. National has a rotary die cutter. Here we can hand jake and hand make dies. So when you see the dies set up for falcon board, reboards, bed board, um, foam boards. A lot of the R&D and development is done here. We have testing devices to test to test loads and tonnage and force of cutting. A laser cutter that is to make die boards in house, so we can turn around our R&D efforts more quickly. The clicker press, which is a wonderful machine for prototyping, uh, we can do sample dies. If you send a die line, for example, we'll take a look at the worst section of that. Worst meaning the most difficult to die cut. We can test it there immediately. And once we've tested a product on the clicker and it looks like we're headed in the right direction with the rule type, the cutting surface, we can then transition to the crest. Next, you'll see our crest 2026 embossing press. Our embossing press is unique in that it has a heater on a moving platen and it has a heater on the head of the press. That reduces ink fracture during the embossing process. It reduces dwell time um, and it improves the quality and consistency of the embossing. We have visual inspection capabilities. So here, this is essentially an electric microscope. We can look at the edge of a cutting knife to see how worn or damaged it is, what the tooth profile is. We have a rubber rebound test, which is testing force. We have a high speed platen test. In here, we can test things like the urethane cutting pads. We can put knife in there, we can put the pad in there, and we can set it up for five, 10, 50,000 hits. So that concludes the tour. I hope you enjoyed it and please, please feel free to engage us, test the crest, bring in your worst die, your worst material, um, or send us your die line, and we'll be happy to take a look at it and provide you feedback as to how to successfully die cut that um, and any questions you may have on die making as well. Thanks.